dear students in my last lecture i had discussed a lot about distance and displacement today we shall see what is the meaning of uniform and non uniform motion non uniform motion but as i had assured you that i shall explain each and every activities given in our ncert science book so see activity 8.4 in page 99 of and c e r t book what is given in this activity the knowledge of two devices that is odometer and speedometer is given so in automobiles there are two devices one is odometer odometer so right what is the meaning of odometer odometer it is a device which measures the distance traveled by any vehicle usually it measures distance in kilometer which is further continuously measured in meters also the second thing is a speedometer a speedometer what is a speedometer it is a device which measures the speed of any vehicle this device measures speed generally in kilometer per hour and you will see that in our different examinations this question is asked again and again that is what is odometer and what is speedometer so in activity 8.4 this is explained and how we can now question arises that how we can use this odometer so suppose if you start your journey from runi saidpur and the reading of odometer is 12051 km and you reach to our destination so right in cl reading again final reading suppose after reaching at your final destination the reading of odometer is 1 2 1 Eight six kilometer. Then, what will be the distance travelled? In this case, the distance travelled is equal to final reading minus initial reading. is equal to what is your final reading 1 2 186 km and what is initial reading 1 2 0 5 1 
kilometer. So, 6 minus 1, 5, 8 minus 5, 3, and 1 minus 0, that is 1. So, the distance traveled by that vehicle is here, 135 kilometer. By doing so, we can easily use autometer and such types of questions are asked continuously. Now, we shall see what is the meaning of uniform and non-uniform motion. So, first of all, see uniform motion. Uniform motion. What do you mean by uniform motion? If any object travels equal distance in equal time interval then the motion is called uniform. For example, if any person travels five kilometer distance in one hour, again five kilometer distance in next hour again 5 kilometer distance in next hour so after every hour he is traveling 5 kilometer distance then such types of motion is called inform motion but in our day to day practice it is not practical because when we start our journey then due to traffic traffic problem or other problems it is not practical to maintain information then how we can give the example of information the example of information is movement of planets around the sun so the motion of our planet earth around the sun is an example of information the movement of satellites around planets in our day-to-day -day practice also suppose it is the time of lockdown there is very less traffic on roads so any person can maintain it but when every person will move on road and different tracks then it becomes very difficult for us to maintain information now what is the meaning of non-uniform motion non uniform motion if any object or person or vehicle if any person trails unequal distance in equal time interval then such types of motion is called non-information non-uniform motion for example suppose we start our journey from any particular point and in first hour our vehicle travels 
30 km distance. Again, in second hour, it travels 35 km distance. In third hour, it travels 40 km distance. But now it is traffic jam. And in fourth hour, very, the vehicle moves very slow and uh, the distance travel is only 10 km. So what we see? We see that in equal time interval, the distance travel is not equal. So such types of motion is called non-infall motion. Dear friends, we are trying our maximum effort for your benefit in this long time also. But for actual outcome, your active participation is required. So I would like to request, request you to share DAB Runi Sadpur YouTube channel and also give information to all of your classmates because practically we are seeing that only 50 to 60 percent students have provided their whatsapp number so help your classmates take maximum benefit and now i'm giving you some homework homework solve exercise given in n c e r t text related to uniform and non uniform motion also huge table eight point one of page one hundred to explain it. Thanks.